What's going on Spartans? Welcome back. Today we're doing a clan war video and guess what guys? If you want to join an awesome clan, join King Spartans. This is my home clan. It's where I spend all my time. It's also the home of Tiff Tiff 2612. If you know her, go check her channel out. She's awesome. And here is our war. Here's a few stats you can check out. Right now we just won actually. 44 to 36. Kind of pissed off we didn't get the 45th star which would have allowed for an extra 25 experience. Ugh. One of our guys is actually unable to do his attacks. He had some family stuff going on. So unfortunately, we would have won it by a little more and got that extra 25, you know, clan XP. But next time, here's D Laws, one of our co leaders attacking. And then you'll see some super high level attacks by uh, Destroyer and myself. We're attacking the top six guys. And you'll be able to see some of those raids. So stay tuned through the whole video. Now, guys, what I do want to say is if you're looking for a good clan where you're willing to donate, um, talk a lot, and of course do all your war attacks then come join we're looking for people willing to do war now um, before I never was a war clan but now I'm looking for people who are very really good at war and people are willing to do war um, if you don't do your war attacks you will be kicked I'm not super strict on losing um, obviously people make mistakes but if you're consistently getting no stars then you're gonna get kicked obviously but I do want people who are very serious about war and donating those are the key things you need to be if so go join King Spartans right now and comment below if you get in or comment below if you do get to uh, apply. It is a level 100 plus clan. It's normally 105 plus, but I actually lower it to level 100 because I'm looking for more specialized players, uh, people who are able to basically do both, not just donate and be active, but also make sure that they are uh, winning their war attacks. So we've got to be very careful on that and make sure we get the right people. If you think you're a right fit, come join now. As you can see, D-Laws is crushing this base 46%. Let's see, he's got the easy 50 in the bag here. Got some wizards, his, his archer queen, and a couple golemites. 50%, there it is. And he got it. Nice two-star, bro. Great job. Much love to our Canadian brother over there. He is uh, one of our best guys. He's awesome. Gotta love him. He's been with me for like two years now, guys. So definitely a loyal clan. Actually, it's been more like two and a half years when I think about it. Jeez. God, getting old. Anyway. So, 56%. Looks like the Queen's going to go down pretty quick here. Here it is. And is she going to get one more? Nope. But he's got some archers he's going to drop. A very nice strategy here on dropping the archers at the end. 57%. Let's speed this up to four times speed. No one needs to see this. 59% is going to be... Looks like, Oh, 60% is the final total. Good job. Nice. All right. So, we're going to pull up the next raid. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying this nice little twist from what we normally do. Insane clan raids. You know. Got to do it insane clan war raids though is what we're doing today and as you can see destroyer is here and he's gonna attack this base this is the number one guy in the other clan and he's got a maxed out base except for his cannons which are not all maxed but they are you know getting there he's working on slowly you can see and I know a bit of a side thought guys but man it is getting nice out weather wise where are you guys from comment below where you're from I know I'm from Chicago and man it is nice 40 something degrees and that is like sweating weather for us here, guys, because 40 degrees is nice and warm. I'm used to like 12 degrees or so, and that's kind of cold. It's kind of brisk. Anything below that's ridiculous, but, you know, 30, 40 degrees is actually pretty nice. I'm actually okay with it. 40, I was actually, it was 42 yesterday, and I was outside in shorts and a, you know, a white tee, just relaxing, going around, doing everything I got to do, get gas, whatever. Uh, you know, just doing my normal, normal stuff. And Destroyer just took that Town Hall at the 28% with it, I think. And that was at 37 just seconds later. This level 40 Queen is going to wreck right here. So he's going to Invis her any second now. Oh, come on, Invis. Invis. Oh, my God. He was so patient. Really well done there. He's going to wait to Invis her until his cannon changes, I'm guessing. And now the cannon's facing her. So he Invis right before the cannonball even hits her. He was very, very focused on the Queen. That is how you have to be with her. You got a babysitter, guys. And many of you know that. But she is very powerful as long as you do babysit her. Look at this, 45%. And oh my god, he's knocking up 47. Nice, wow, holy crap. Now he's got a couple archers left and minions. And he's going to get the easy 50 here. Let's see how he cleans it up. Not the best place on that one archer, but everything else is good. He's going to go for that dark elixir mine, I'm guessing. I would, I would go for it. It looks like it's an easy hit. And if you guys didn't see, I'm working with white lightning, guys. Holy crap. I know a lot of you are huge fans of White Lightning. He's an awesome, awesome YouTuber. Go check his channel out. If you are not a fan of his, you will be. He is awesome. Love the guy. 
definitely do me a favor go comment on his video say king loves him he did that on my youtube for uh, clash army and he blew up one of my videos so everyone that can is watching this still go blow his channel up with king loves you hashtag spartans for life hashtag whatever you know what i mean just blow it up and then make sure you tell me how many people did it because that's gonna be funny as hell i want to see his channel just explode i'm gonna do the same thing for uh, clash army in a day or two here where we attack his channel with love but uh, <laughs> want to see how much support we can get from this channel. Hopefully a couple hundred people go do it, which would be really awesome. Make sure you like this video if you're enjoying it. And here is my attack. You know it, guys. We're attacking with Quattro Go Wipe, and I completely screwed up here. I dropped my clan castle right here, which I thought would draw the clan castle from the enemy, and it didn't because I was stupid. I was supposed to drop it on the right side of the base up top and draw that clan castle, but I didn't. I kind of forgot, and I just decided to wall break all the way in from this bottom corner here. You can see just raging my guys up to make sure they blow all the way through to the center. And then, now our guys are actually rolling in. The golems are not in the middle. This is bad news. I don't like that, guys. The golems are supposed to be at the lead in the front, but they kind of got stuck on walls. But they're getting their way back over there. So I actually enraged my king, threw a free spell down on both the target or multi-target inferno and the clan castle troops, which was helpful. Made sure our guys survived. And then dropped a lightning spell right now to help out. Um, the lightning spell was terribly placed. It was meant to hit the Tesla, but I kind of like slipped when I was touching the screen and dropped it all over the place. Anyway, so as you can see, the jump spell is actually opening up other quadrants. And the queen is at 30. Oh my god, level 34. I forgot I upgraded her. That's awesome. I just actually jumped her down because she was she had like a day left and it was war. And I was like, screw it, I need her. Anyway, 49%. She gets a 50 right there. That golem is helping out by taking the hits from that archer tower. She's at 53%, climbing quick. And invis, boom, there it goes. And she takes out a bunch of more stuff. Look at this, 55, 56, 57, 58. We're just counting because we can. Can she get the 60? Oh my god, she does, 60%. Pretty awesome, guys. I'm excited about that. So a pretty solid war attack, in my opinion. I think it was pretty awesome. What do you guys think? Um, do you think I could have done better on this? I don't know. Probably could have, but definitely crush this guy. 62, it looks like we're going to go down with like 63, 64% here, maybe a little higher. And we're going to speed this up, drop the rest of these archers down, and take out these two buildings. And come on, any second. Do it. Do it now. And it's 64. Can we get 65? We do. 65%. Awesome. So that's going to call it right there. 65%. And we do get the nice two-star. Gotta love it. And now we're going to move on. Show one more raid. And unfortunately, guys, I'm actually not going to have time to show my second raid, which is a Garch raid. It actually made me really angry. I attacked like number 10 or 11. And I got one star, and it made me mad because it was a guaranteed two star. Like, I got the 50%, but the queen ran out of time. Like, literally, she got distracted by skeleton traps and shit, and ended up walking outside of the base when she was about to target the town hall. Walked outside the base, fought a skeleton trap, and then took out two or three more buildings, including a gold storage. Then walked back in and faced a Tesla. Like, it was ridiculous, guys. If I even show it to you, you'd just be sitting there like, what are you doing? Like, just screaming into the mic or, you know, into the computer. Whatever you do, you know. However you do it. But, yeah, I was really mad when I was doing the raid. I was like, what are you doing, queen? Get the fuck back in there. Pardon my language. Anyway, 25% almost here and crushing it. Go, destroyer, go. And, of course, he's in the middle of the base, which is all he needs to get that guaranteed win. Level 40 king and queen are going to kill this bait. Now, as you can see... He has taken the center out pretty much completely, and I think his level 40 king can clear the rest out. The question is, what is his queen doing? Is the queen going to be useful? Probably. But let's see how much he can get without her. Here we go. Queen is up top, on the, you can see here, and I'm just focused on the king. Now the king's going to get distracted, have to go through a jump spell, and he's going to have a little bit of free reign here with some golems. And hopefully the golems can take out a little bit. 47%, the queen is invised, and as you can see, she is going to take out one more building, I think, before she goes down. Maybe two if she gets lucky. There it is. 40, 50. Oh my god, we got two stars. And she's not even dead. What? She's so strong at level 40. Man, I can't wait. I'm going to get mine to level 35 this week. That's it. I'm upgrading her in like a day here. So like a day or two, I'll upgrade my queen. And then she'll be at level 35 in a week, which would be sick. Super excited to have that. That's only one complete level away, basically. Like, you know, every five set you get an upgrade. So 40 will be ridiculous, but 35 is going to be pretty OP. I'm excited for that. He's dropping down his troops now. Just taking out the extra percentages. As you can see, 55%. We're going to speed this up for you nice and fast. Two times speed. And now we're going to throw it on four soon, I think. Come on. Come on. I know I did it. Any second now. Anyway, 61%. That's pretty solid. And now his archers are down, which is good. Here's that four times speed I promised you. He pulls a skelly trap, though, which sucked. And he got 66%. 
Now, it's been a while since I did a 12 minute long video, guys. 13, actually. I'm pretty pumped about that. Did you guys enjoy it? If so, let me know that you want more extended play videos, like longer. I've been doing a lot of 5 to 8 minute videos because people are really liking them. But if you guys want to see some 10 to 12 minute videos, I'm cool making them, guys. I have no problem doing it. Uh, we can just chat, have some fun, and play a lot of games. Maybe I'll start putting some music back in if we want and do like 15 minute videos. I have, oh my god, I forgot to upload the 20 minute video for Boom Beach today. I'm sorry, guys. I completely forgot. I was supposed to do it before I went to bed last night. So, uh, yeah. That'll be tomorrow, in case you were curious. Go check it out tomorrow. My god. I apologize. I had a time. Once again. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Wow. Epic fail. Man, I'm kind of mad at myself for that one. That was an awesome video. It really wasn't, though. It was just a ton of Dr. Terror, man. It was a ton of it. Like, we just went on and on and on. It was like 12, 12 levels, I think. It was crazy. Anyway, as you can see, he is drawing out this... Witch. I would have killed the witch already, man. Look at that. They're just sitting there. They're just primed for the taking. I'd have dropped a barb on each of them and just said, fuck it. Die. But hey, No Hulk is actually one of my first members of ever my clan. Just like D-Laws. He's been here since the beginning. So, old, old pale. And also a co-leader. As you can see, he is killing this witch, though. Kill him. Oh my god, he killed the wizard. <laughs> go, Pekka, go. Anyway, this Pekka might have some trouble here because of these stupid skeletons. My god. Anyway, he's got some witches of his own down. That'll spell some trouble for his entire base, which is good news. And he's already got that jump spell pushing him toward the center of the base, which is good because that double Tesla will draw his troops all the way in there. Now, with the free spell, he's going to save his... Oh, my God, what are they doing? Come on, go. Get in there. Get in there and kill them all. Anyway, so they're going to kill it, as you can see. And they are doing well. 29%. And no Hulk's going to get the nice little town hall. Oh, my God. Stop being distracted. They're really getting... You know, flustered and walking around everywhere in there. That's not good. But the king is targeted on the town hall. He's going to get it. Nice one star, 39%. Going for the second star. Got a P.E.K.K.A. left, a golem. Shouldn't be too big a problem. As long as that golem's alive and the queen is, he should get the 50% without an issue. As you can see, though, the golems are going down fast. And it's 47%. The queen is level 25. He should have an easy 50 here. But let's check it out. Let's see if he gets it. He should. Come on, go through that wall, queen. Have you ever noticed how long queens spend on walls? It's absolutely absurd. And here we go, 47, come on, 48%. And gold storage is going to be the 50, is it? 49, oh my god. Invis queen still, oh my god, 50% it is. And the queen gets targeted. Now, he's going to leave because he knows he can't get anything better. He's going to get like one more building and like sacrifice half a queen for it. So not worth it, but he did get a nice 50%. Very well done. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully I see you guys in my clan soon. If so, I will talk to you guys there. See you guys soon. Peace.